Well, I'm back and it's now time to quilt this. So we've got our pink and light blue and white on the front. I have a whole bunch of this dark blue left over from the first quilt that I did. So I think even though it's not an exact match color wise, it's still gonna pull in there nicely. And then with this as the binding, it's gonna come together really well. And as far as designs go, I think I'm gonna go with just something loopy, nothing super dense or anything. Sure, I could quilt cats on it because I have a couple different cat designs, but I think I want to let the prints and the design stand for themselves and just some all over loopy, almost kind of like a meander. I know I've used this design before, but I think it'll look cute on here. So let's get to quilting. All basted in and ready to quilt. So let's make this happen. So this is the cakewalk pantograph and I think it turned out really cute so far so obviously only my first zone but it's kind of like it looks like little like yarn twirls which is perfect for these little kitty cats and because I did the white thread it's blending in quite nicely so I'm going to get this set up to just keep going and going and going. So I've gone ahead and trimmed off my extra batting already just so it's not an enticement for a little four-legged friend of mine. And so now I'm going to get this off the frame, trim it all up, and get my binding on so then it'll be all done. That's super fantastic. And this, I really like how this quilting turned out. So fun. And it even looks good on the blue. So I cut the same amount of strips, just a little bit wider, 
And look how short it is. I'm that short to get my binding. So now I've got to see, one, if I have a chunk of this anymore, and two, if I don't, how I'm gonna scrappy this to make it fit, because that's right at the top corner. So I'm gonna investigate and hopefully fix that. I might be a little bit biased, but I think this kitty quilt turned out pretty cute, even when it's upside down. So I love how this pantograph turned out. It's that cakewalk pantograph. It kind of just gives it that yarn look without overpowering the pattern of the quilt itself with these kitty prints. And once I got my half square triangles all situated, it wasn't too bad to get them all laid out. So, though, so it could have been fussy cut better, but for what it is, I think it's really cute. And I know my big concern at one point was this being the binding, but I think it's kind of fun having these little occasional spots where you have these little eyeballs peeking out. So I'm excited to add this to my done pile and let's go do a quilt drop reveal and then show you some pictures of it.